Welcome back to another cooking video. I'm Chef Deville and today I'm going to teach you how to make a Korean spicy sauce that you can add to delicious barbecue, grilled food or deep fried food and it'll just make it so delicious as long as you like spicy food. Because if you don't like spicy food then this one's not for you. Okay, so with nothing more to be said, let's get cooking. Let's do this. Okay, so first thing you want to do is just take some sesame seeds and place them into a pan and you just want to toast them for a little bit. So just bring the heat up and cook them for about three to four minutes and just shake them about just like this. And this will release the essential aromas inside and the oils and just freshen and liven up the smells and taste of the sesame seeds. Okay, so once that's done, you're just gonna to wanna to put this to one side. And then you're gonna take your 100 grams of gochujang paste, which is a Korean fermented chili paste. This is awesome stuff. All right, so 100 grams of that will make the base of the sauce. And then I'm just gonna add 26 grams of sugar, followed by 20 grams of sake, and 20 grams of soy sauce, and then 30 grams of freshly juiced apple juice, eight grams of garlic, and six grams of sesame seeds, the toasted ones I just toasted before in the pan. And last but not least, 20 grams of sesame seed oil. Okay. And then just simply mix this in together with a spoon until the sugars dissolve into the liquid. And that's really it. It's the simplest sauce you can make. As long as you've got all the ingredients, you just mix them together and done. It's that simple. And this is just an amazing sauce that, like I said, you can add this to a lot of things. All right, so there we go. This is how you make that Korean style spicy sauce. Now go ahead, make this at home and put it on everything you can find to eat, you know? Even an apple, if that's the only thing. Probably not an apple, don't put it on an apple. It'll be bad. <laughs> okay, so if you wanna check out some more of my sauce recipes, then click on the top right corner of your screen to go to a playlist where you can check them out and see everything I've made in sauces. If you wanna see some more videos of mine, like sushi videos and whatever, then click on the right here. And if you wanna see some more videos of mine in the future when I make new videos, then click on the top left corner of your screen to subscribe to my channel right now and be notified when new videos come out. Thank you for watching, see you guys next week, goodbye.